Attorneys for Senator Bob Menendez now getting their chance to defend their client against accusations that he was taking bribes. In Manhattan Federal Court, the defense called their first witnesses. One was related to the senator by blood, another by marriage. News 12 New Jersey's Chris Keating with the latest. The first witness to be called on to defend Senator Bob Menendez was his own sister, 80-year-old Caridad Gonzalez. She would explain to jurors why it should be of no surprise to them that the senator had $400,000 in cash stashed away in his home within boots, jackets, and bags. The senator's sister, Caridad Gonzalez, seen here outside of the courthouse, was on the stand for about an hour. She said that because of the family's Cuban background, it should come as no shock that her baby brother, which is how she described him, had cash inside of his and Nadine's Englewood Cliffs home. Gonzalez testified, it was normal, he's a Cuban. Every Cuban that came to the US in the 50s, 60s, and 70s, you'll find cash in the home. In Cuba, they take everything away from you. She explained that she was born in Cuba and the family had left Havana for the US because her father's business was being threatened for takeover. The senator was born in New Jersey. Carrie Dodd said her mother and father always hid cash and told their children to do the same. Daddy always said, don't trust the banks, always have money at home. My mom would take some out of her check and in the frames of the closet, she would stick it in there. Carrie Dodd explained for the defense that she would often call on her brother to help people in the community with immigration issues. The defense is trying to show it was his cultural upbringing that caused the senator to hoard all that cash, not bribery. Menendez and his wife Nadine are accused of taking bribes of cash and gold from defendants Fred Davies and Yael Hanna. The feds allege Davies wanted help in landing a $95 million investment deal with the royal family of Qatar. Menendez is also accused of approving military aid for Egypt in return. The government says Hanna would become the sole certifier of halal meat to that country. Following Gonzalez, Nadine's sister Katia Taborian took the stand. Leaving the courthouse, she did not want to be seen. She told the jurors that the family was from Lebanon, where it was common for gifts of gold. The defense was trying to show that gold found in Nadine's closet could have been gifts from relatives when born or given to her by their father. However, on cross-examination, Taborian was asked about an inventory of gold owned by her father dated 1976. The prosecutor asked, do you have any idea if the serial numbers correspond with the numbers of gold owned by Fred Davies? To which Taborian said, no. Prosecutors stated much earlier in the trial that serial numbers on gold found in Nadine's closet correspond with the inventory of gold belonging to defendant Davies. The defense is expected to call several more witnesses. It's still not clear if the senator will take the stand. Chris Keating, News 12, New Jersey.